Mada, mada, nana. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to the next episode of Chrono Trigger. We had a really bad episode. I mean, it wasn't really entertaining, good, in general. They were gonna go into the sewers, though, and make up for all of that. So, bandits must report to Sir Crawley. Oh, crap. Alright, found 600G. There was a bridge here. I saw it. Ribbit. Fool, Gribbit. There's nothing here. But, but, it's true, Ribbit. Someone's coming. Let's scram, Gribbit. There's a tad on the spooky side. This is a near you place. I've got a bad feeling about this. Oh, okay. Screwing me over. Pfft. Get him away. Jeez. Mm. All right. Um, I don't know where to go. Just a little bit. Mm -hmm. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, wait, wait, I'm trying to remember what episode this is. Yeah, 32, yeah. guys think about this. And jump! No. Food.
I'm gonna go up here. Press the switch and the bridge opens, ribbit. So switch on, ribbit. Ribbit. It's out of reach, ribbit. Boss. And you call yourself a frog, ribbit, ribbit. Someone's coming, let's scram. Hey, I'm here. Did you guys scram yet? Big hunky dudes. I'm just kidding. Oh, God. Got a rage band. Three of them are almost there. Coming through the sewer like they own it. They must have a death wish. We shall teach them a lesson. Let's show them. Hee <laughs> hee. Just let them come through here. They already chopped liver. Ha. Hee <laughs> hee. Ha ha ha. Ha ha ha. Hee <laughs> hee. Huh? Oh god dang, he got evaporated. 100 experience points, 5 tech points, 500g, mid ether, and such. Alright, that's cool, I guess. Um, let's see, let's just continue going on. After the caterpillar got killed. Bolt sword. We already have a bolt sword. Oh, dang. Whole new area. Keeper's dome. Please do not disturb my slumber. I want to, though. Screw you, buddy. There we go, that's better. Dependent shimmers. Doo doo doo. Huh? To those who opened the door, I am Belthasar, the guru of reason. I once lived in the kingdom of Zeal. A great disaster in Zeal somehow threw me into this area. To my surprise, Lavos exists here, and I suspect in other periods as well. Aeons ago, Lavos descended from the heavens. Burrowing deep into the world's core, he began to consume our planet's energy and grow stronger. Lavos disappeared briefly when he was summoned away by a mighty wizard who lived in Guardia in the year 600. In 1999, Lavos claims this area and reigns from the high atop Death Peak. Dang. God dang. For still of here, I continue to conduct research on Lavos, but I'm growing old. It's impossible to keep sane in such trying times. So before I lose it completely, I shall safeguard my data and my ultimate creation. How I long to return home, but I have grown feral. So you, you who have opened the pro door, I leave things in your hands. Only by mastering them itself do you stand a chance against Lavos. The odds will be against you, but you are true heroes. The world is in your hands. Open now the last door and take what you find there. My last invention. My wings of time. This must be the invention Balthasar spoke of. Wow, this is amazing. How do you tell the front from the back? Can we get in it? Can we get in it? Well, we'll figure that out in the next episode, I think. See you guys in episode 33 of Chrono Trigger. Woo!